This is a box full of 280 PSA graded cards. And I waited over 450 days to get them back from being graded. Today, we open them all up on camera. What is up, you guys? We've been waiting since 2020 to get this PSA return, which is just entirely too large to show on the camera. Okay, we'll do it. Okay, here it is, just for a quick look at it. But first, we have an insane giveaway. One of my Patreon members sent this to Phil from me and truly appreciate all you do to make such awesome content and a oh, great. That's not the same word. Here's what he sent. A ghost rare blue eyes alternative white dragon. This will be given away to one of you guys. All you have to do is like this video, click that notification bell, and let me know what your favorite card from the return is. This is going to be a long one, so let's hop into it. There are tons of these boxes in here. So we're just going to take it one at a time because that's just what you got to do. I don't know what else we could possibly do. Let's see if this is the correct side without spoiling anything. So in this return, I think like 70-ish of these 280 cards were not mine. So... Some of them may not be mine. These are definitely mine. This is an LOB first edition card. By the way, this is from an LOB box that we opened like a year and a half, two years ago. That shows you how old this return is. So we have Cherubin the Fire Knight. Can we get some PSA 10s? We're not going to take crazy long like we do sometimes where we check out all the corners. because We have 280 cards. I don't want you guys to be here all day, but let's see what we got. A mint nine. So we're starting it off with nines. Centering is not perfect on this guy. So maybe that's what it is. We are going to be hoping for some of those PSA 10s on those rares because they are pretty nice cards. So here it looks like we have another that I pulled all of these, by the way. These are all pulled by me. So Spirit of the Heart first edition. Gem mint 10. That's a nice LOB first edition rare. Next card. We have another Spirit of the Heart. So it looks like I had doubles of this one. Okay. I did open a couple of boxes. So I'm in nine. Okay, so we're one out of three so far. Not the best start, but it's not the worst. Giant Soldier of Stone. This is a pretty cool card. Yeah, the very iconic from the anime. Let's see what we can get. Mint 9. Oh, this is not a good start. All these are packed fresh and very nice. So I only sent the ones that I thought could get 10. So, so far, not the best start in terms of what we want. We have on the Giant Soldier. Okay, Gem Mint. So we're 2 out of 5. That's not the worst. Not the worst. I could be doing a lot worse for sure. We got Aquam Door. So it looks like we are on the LOB Rare Train right now. Mid nine, okay. A lot of mid nines, a lot of mid nines. We got a Reaper of the Cards. Very cool card. Yeah, just very, very cool card. Okay. And another mid nine. Oh my gosh, they're really. I'm not sure what they're hitting these for. Reaper of the Cards. Okay, there's a gem mid ten. So if we have doubles, we've gotten like one nine, one ten so far, which. It's a little, oh, I just ruined it. Okay. Jim Mint 10. Hey, hey, I forgot to cover it up. We will take that. Maybe we should just not even cover up these rares and stuff because there's going to be a lot of them. Okay, so next card, what's it going to be? Ooh, a mint nine, hain hain. Okay, so look, it's splitting every time. If you have two, you're not getting two tens. Here we go. Ooh, an arm ninja. Okay. So it looks like we're pretty even in terms of nines and tens so far, which is not the worst. I'm not going to complain about that. And... Oh, the pot of greed got a nine. This is actually a big one. Oh, whoa, this one is actually off-centered. So yeah, that actually makes sense. I don't know why. I Probably just because it's pot of greed is probably why I sent it. Okay, okay. Do we have another pot? Oh, it's another nine. Oh, this one's also kind of off-centered a little bit. This one's definitely better. Okay, two, two pot of greed's got nines. That's unfortunate. Do we have a third? <laughs> no! The nine trifecta. This one actually looks pretty centered. So I'm not sure about this one. It's hard to really tell, but okay. Three nines, unfortunately. I don't think I had four. Uh, final flame nine. Okay, it's nine central out here. Can we get something good? Another nine. Okay, another nine. All right, come on, come on. Another nine. Okay unfortunate because you know a lot of, if they're not off center then they should be pretty perfect fissure got a nine can we get another 10 it's been a while and another nine okay great by the way there are other cards that are not like lob commons and rares but uh not the best star let's see what we can do we've got okay now we're into the commons the new miruka that's a psa 10 very nice we have a c spike cedra got a nine We've got the, ooh, the 13th grave. Got a PSA 10. Very nice. If you guys are interested in some of these LOB stuff, then just hit me up. We're really anything, but uh, Larvis. Some of these are not mine, though, but all of this stuff is mine because I graded these for my box, so push those back a little bit. We have Succubus 9. Unfortunately, the Succubus got a 9. Okay, not great. And, oh, no, our first 8 in Warrior number 2. What did he do? Where's the 8? Is there something going on over there? I can't tell. Okay, this is nothing i don't know what it, that in the middle i don't i think that's just like the psa case seal i don't know what's going on i don't know about that one okay oh and there we go witty phantom psa 10 we will take that we have basic insects ah a nine weevil would not be happy with this a mint nine no all right sorry for creeping y'all out oh look we're back to the rares which that is a nine this this nine stack is gonna go above the camera <laughs> 
An eight? What? Oh, come on. Centering is good. It's pretty good, actually. Wow. Okay. What's the eight here? You guys see this? You guys see how crispy this card is? Like the surface? How is this an eight? Hello? Hello? What's an eight about it? It's packed fresh. You can even see the gloss on the card. Like there's no scratching. That's straight out of the pack. Look at that. You can see it throughout the entire card. Why is that an eight? I don't know. That makes no sense. That, uh, that one makes no sense. Okay. Next one. Flower Wolf 9. Man, they are really killing us on these rares. These are, these are rough. We have another nine all of these are pack fresh all of these and i didn't even send everything i sent everything besides the pot of greeds that was centered another nine okay another nine wow okay now yeah, finally we got a 10 a metal dragon all right metal dragon at the psa 10 man we we started off getting a decent amount of 10s now we're just getting all nines okay another nine okay shocking all right we're gonna have literally a, an eiffel tower here another nine okay all out of the box by the way okay another eight okay what's wrong with this one why is this an eight an eight i pulled it so the back looks i mean you guys can see the gloss on it it looks super nice i don't know why would this get an eight wow how is that an eight i don't know okay and a nine on to the next card we have another nine okay shocking shocking we have another nine for the arm mail we have a psa 10 fire grass okay we got a fire grass cool a nine okay yeah impossible to get two tens from the same card a root water very nice okay so we're not even halfway up the nines but we are doing okay oh another root water okay wait we got two of the same card i just jinxed it into existence a nine mammoth graveyard okay mammoth graveyard got destroyed a 10 mammoth graveyard okay that's good to see another 10 mammoth graveyard okay maybe this is the redemption here maybe we just had the bad box no nope, there's the nine we're back to the nines we're back where we belong oh a dark world thorns okay I'm, trying, I'm gonna go through these comments pretty quickly to get to the, the big stuff. Mizurizame, is there a Yame in here? Probably. Another Mizurizame getting a nine. Ah, oh, Mizurizame! Yeah, we need Mizurizame Yame. That's a PSA 10. Skull Red Bird got a nine. We've got Skull Red Bird got a nine. All right. We've got Skull Red Bird got an eight. What? An eight? Look at the centering on this thing. That's like the most centered card we've seen yet. What are these eights? I don't know what's going on. These eights make no sense. It's like the most centered card yet. I don't know. I don't understand that. Okay. Skull Servant. Oh, that would have been a nice 10. Unfortunately not. And we have another one. It's another nine. Feeling great about this so far. Let's see what else we got. We've got a nine on another rare. Okay. We have a PSA 10 Goblin Seeker Remedy. That's good to see. Dragon Capture Jar. It was captured. We have, oh, a PSA 10 Dragon Capture Jar. That's nice. PSA 9 Dragon Capture Jar. Oh, what? Okay, so we finally got to a non-rare uh, or common Guy the Dragon Champion. This is an 8, apparently. Okay, that's awesome. Reprint 8. Okay, all right. I don't know why it's an 8. Um, I mean, the, the reprints are never perfect, but man, 8, I was not expecting that. Okay, there's an 8. See, maybe these will be more of this stuff. No, it's back to commons. Okay, they're a little bit mixed up, I think. We got a Wasteland, 9. Armored Starfish, PSA 10. Okay, when I have the 9s, it's almost still taller than the 10s. An 8? What the heck? These are ones that I pulled. Pack Fresh, Secret Rare 8s. Okay, so Trihorned. That card is slightly off-centered. Okay, corners look great on this thing. That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Oh, look, we got a 9. And this is the original print. So it looks like the ori Did I pull this? Oh, this is an EN. Okay, I did pull this. This is the original print, and this got a 9. So it looks like the reprint just does worse. So this card's super minty. I think it's a little bit off-center. Yeah, it's a little off-center. So I think a 9 is pretty fair on that one. Makes sense, at least. Next one. Tell me how this is possible. Centering is not completely perfect, but it's not terrible. Do we got some print lines in here or something? Because sometimes these original, uh, or not original, these reprint foils are pretty easy to have like print lines, but I'm not seeing much. It's really hard to tell under the slab, but uh, okay. Maybe is that a little nick right there? A tiny little whitening. Okay, there's something there. I don't think that, I don't think I submitted a, I mean, this was a, a remember, 15 months ago, so I could be wrong, but seven. Okay, that's, that's great. Of course, it's on the blue eyes too. Okay, next up, we have a seven. Are you kidding me? They hate these reprints. Where's the damage? Okay, next one. An eight, another reprint. All these reprints are gonna get eights and sevens, apparently. I'm not even gonna look at it because we know it's just because it's a reprint. 
A seven. We pulled all of these. We pulled every single one of these in eight. We have not gotten better than a seven or eight on a reprint. Wow. Wow. Oh my goodness. What the heck? Oh, <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh, man. That is ridiculous. A sevens and eights. On to the next one. All right, on to the next one. We have a tie on. So we're back to, uh, am I not out of these yet? Okay, we got a 10 on that. Okay, the only thing we've gotten a 10 on so far are commons and rares. Just saying. Okay, Jim and 10. That's nice. A nine. Okay. Beaver Warrior. Okay, we need a 10 on the Beaver Warrior. Uh, two nines. Never mind. Armored Starfish. That's our second one of that one, I think. Oh my gosh. An eight on a common. Okay, great. Uh, nine on the Enchanting Mermaid. Nine on the uh, Fiend Reflection number two. Nine on the Sandstone. Lesser Dragon got a 10. Okay. Masaki got a nine, unfortunately. Green Phantom King. That's a PSA 10. We'll take that. He taught to me giant another 10. Okay, this is this is better. It's a bunch of commons, but okay, enchanting mermaid. The 10 stack is definitely improving here. Trial of hell nine. Naturally, naturally. Do we have another one? Nope. Dissolve rock nine. And <laughs> gotta end it on the eight and just smack you in the face when you think you're doing alright. Okay. <laughs> this is a joke. This is a joke. Seven, man. Seven. Okay, just mark them down to sevens if they're reprints. Maybe an eight. Yep, there's an eight. There's there's the good one. We got an eight. An eight. Will we get above an eight on a reprint? Okay, that's not a reprint. Yeah, we got a nine, but it's not a reprint. It's original print. So we got a nine on the original print Mystical Elf, which has a very large foil shift over there, which is pretty cool, actually. That one, a uh, little bit off-center, so it probably deserves that. Here we go. Oh, a PSA 10. I pulled this one. This is an original print Celtic Guardian. Our first foil 10. Can you believe it? Yeah, this is an original print Celtic Guardian we pulled a very long time ago. I had it laying around when I sent out this bulk submission. Very good chance for a 10. And it got the 10. All right. Gay Guardian got an 8 because he's a reprint. That's why. That's literally why. An 8 because he's a reprint. All right. And uh, Genzo is a reprint. Nope. Oh, Blue Eyes Toon Dragon as a reprint. All right. Great. Uh, an 8 because it's a reprint. Awesome. We've got a Genzo that's a reprint, so we got an 8. All right, that's great. Uh, oh, look, a PSA 9 on a reprint. This means this card is completely perfect because every other card was almost perfect, and they got 7s and 8s. So this card must be like Black Label BGS level at this point because I don't even understand, like, well, like what makes this one better? They look the same. Centering is, like, perfect on this card. Okay, awesome. Vampire Lord 8. So, so far, we've gotten one reprint. Oh, there's a 7 on the Exodia Necross. Very nice. Awesome. Uh, oh look, Chaos Ember Dragon got a 9. Woohoo! Yeah, this one is completely off-centered. So why is this the 9 versus uh, the other ones? I don't understand at all because they're all... I pulled all of them, so I don't see the difference here. Now, a 7 on the Black Cluster Soul. I did not pull that one, so that, that makes sense because I hadn't pulled that one at that point. Oh, the Nibble Mamanga Champion Pack 2 got a 9, unfortunately. That is an older print, though, so maybe we have a chance. And another 9, both of them. Ah, I thought they were pretty nice. And... Smashing Ground also got a 9. 15 months, totally worth it. Totally worth it for the 7s, baby. We have a Sparks 9. Okay, Sparks, good to see you back. The best card in Yu-Gi-Oh. Yame! We got a Missouri Zame. Yame. So at least we got that. We got the Missouri Zame. Yame. And Hinotama. Okay. Very similar to Sparks, just better. Okay, another Hinotama 9. Man, we have a lot of 9s here. We have a 8. Okay, awesome. Love to see that. We have a, oh, a 10 forest. That, I just love this card. Isn't this pretty? This is some really nice green. I like it. Then we have mountain. Okay. Our, our magic cards are doing well. Okay. Never mind. We, we jinxed it. Silver bow and arrow. Ooh, book of secret arts. That's a cool card. Uh, legendary sword. We've got mystical moon. These are nice cards. I mean, these are some nice ones. Dragon treasure. Okay. This is, this is all right. All right. Laser cannon armor. That might be a short print actually. So that's a pretty good one. Mystical Sheep number two wanted to be a nine. Oh, there was a 10 of the Mystical Sheep number two. Okay, and Warrior number one, unfortunately. Wait, this is the one that, yeah, this does have the shifted. They're all like this, by the way, but it's still really cool. Next we have, oh, a 10. Okay, that's nice. Oh, Yurabi is a nine. That'd be a cool 10. And, oh, there's a 10. All right, we got it.
Okay, these are not mine. Okay, the Shein, I did not send this one in. So there's a an eight. So I'm gonna separate this on its own pile because it's not mine. Uh, yeah, okay, this is that caliber, another eight. So man, they are eight happy today. And sevens, like we got so many sevens. Uh, ooh, Brain Control, that's a pretty card. That got a nine. Oh, by the way, this is for Yugi Vault, who will be starting to post back on his YouTube channel again. And so go check out his channel if you guys wanna see uh, his returns and stuff like that. So, oh, we got a PSA 10 Tempest. That is awesome. We did have a couple upcharges. That could be one of them, I don't know. It's definitely not mine. Oh, the Dark Paladin. So it looks like he's sending better cards than me. Dark Paladin and Tempest PSA 10. So I'm happy for him at least getting something good because so far it's been pretty rough for us. Ooh, a Magician of Black Chaos. That's a pretty card. We have a MX Saber Invoker. It's an Invoker. That's an 8, unfortunately. Ooh, Hieratic Sun Dragon Overlord of Helipolis. Helipolis. Man, this is originally from Galactic Overlord. I didn't know that. Next card, we have another 7. Okay. We have the XC's Unit. All right, all right. That's uh, an 8. Oh, the Blue Eyes White Dragon. That's super cool. I love this Secret Rare print. That's beautiful. That's a pretty sick card. And oh, we got another one. Man, that's actually awesome. I, I'm pretty jealous of that. Blue Eyes. Oh, I got a seven. Okay. <laughs> All right. That'll average it out. There's an eight. Okay. An eight. A nine? Seven, eight, nine. Oh my gosh. Is this going to be a 10? No, it's a Dark Magician Girl. Okay. Not bad. Another nine. He got a 10. Nice. That's nice. A secret rare dark magician girl. That's pretty good. And he graded a verte. Nice. Okay. You might uh, you might just want to use this one in your deck because I got an 8. <laughs> there are so many boxes on my floor now. It's ridiculous. Here we go. Let's see what we got. Oh, my turtle got a 9. No, we pulled those two. Can we get a 10, please? Oh, and the magical stone got a 10. Okay. That's actually our first big box big return like this is actually mine this is a psa 10 from champion pack 2 i got a nine the first time i graded one of these so i actually needed that one that's actually pretty big then we've got a nine okay there's i graded two of those i guess we have oh this is the one we pulled from the ax starter box unfortunately got the nine but this is a very nice card this is a very old video at this point because it was obviously over a year and a half ago that we posted i'll pop it up if i can even find it at this point i don't remember what i called it that's sick i think there's a dark magician too right no, a Lord of D. Look at this. This is sick. PSA 10. Look at that secret rare. Yeah, this is the promo. For some reason, this was the secret rare. It's kind of weird, but pretty cool. All right, we're finally getting some good cards. And then there was the Flute of Summoning Dragon was in there as well. That got an A, but who cares? It's a freaking flute. Still would have been nice, but we'll see. Judge Man super rare. That's so cool, but it got the 9. Any other 10s? Any other 10s, please? unfortunate to say the least but still a very cool card uh this looks i mean this looks pretty nice this is the centering on it it's pretty well the centering is pretty bad that's probably why i got the eight okay oh that's sick a wing dragon guardian of the fortress psa 10 that is really really cool i like that i'm a big fan of that one that and our lord of d <laughs> oh and we got a cloudy and sheep plot i i can't remember this is either mine or his. I can't remember which one that is. And a Shein's Chancellor from Glass. Okay, another nice one. We have Harpy Lady Sisters got a nine. Yeah, this was mine. I remember this. This card was minty. Centering looks amazing. Wow, that is that is a rough nine right there. This is definitely... Uh, is the centering slightly off? Yeah, it is a little bit off. Maybe that's why, but that's a nice card. We have a few other Metal Raiders cards. Oh, a PSA 10 Suigen. Yep, there's one of them. All right, that's amazing. I can't remember if I... I think I might have pulled this. I can't remember exactly, but PSA 10 Suigen. Centering looks very similar to that Harpy Lady, except going the other way, but we'll take it, though. We'll take a PSA 10 Suigen. We finally got a decent card out of this return. We are doing a little better, though, since those reprints, but those reprints just really, really they just aggravated me. <laughs> I know we pulled this one. Twin-headed Thunder Dragon. I remember pulling this. PSA 10. We will take that. Metal Raiders doing us pretty well so far. Metal Raiders always does great pretty, pretty well. Garnesia Elephantis. Okay, now we're hitting the good stuff. Now we're hitting the good stuff. That's nice. Garnesia, we'll take that. And, oh, this Portuguese Dark Magician, which, wow, that, that's a nice card, unfortunately. Okay, nice nine. Okay, what else? Oh! Oh! Portuguese Blue Eyes White Dragon First Edition. Jim Mint 10. Let's go! We're making up for those sevens, baby. Let's go! This has been a roller coaster ride. Oh my gosh! What, oh wow. Okay, now now I'm I'm feeling better now. Oh! 
Oh! Oh my goodness! A Needleworm PSA 10! Oh, we pulled this guy too! Okay, this started off terrible. Like, I was like, this is gonna be the worst return. This is turned around. Needleworm? I was not expecting that. Sittering's actually not too bad for a Needleworm, even though it's not the TP3, which is insanely, like, rare and very difficult to get centered. But, oh my goodness! Needleworm PSA 10! I have a lot of TP5 hollows. I might have all of those in 10. I'm not totally sure. Oh, and there's a TP5. He got a nine. I already have like, I had two of these, I think, or at least one. So uh, yeah, I, don't, I didn't need another one of those, but that's so cool. Definitely feeling a lot better after those reprint. Well, okay, this was not my card. I, I'm pretty sure I didn't grade this one. So maybe, did he send in like a bent card or something by accident? I didn't actually check him out. I did have a pre-video where I talked about what we were sending off just so I could keep track of it, but I didn't actually like check him like for him. So that was okay. We don't know about that one. Uh, question. Yeah, these are definitely his. Uh, United we stand eight. Okay. I mean, these are not terrible. Not terrible. Nine on the fiber jar. That's pretty nice. Okay. I'm pretty sure these are his at least. Double spell. Okay. I'm pretty sure I didn't send any of these. A dark necro fear. Oh, that's such a nice card. PSA eight. Okay. We're looking for those nines really. I think on a lot of this stuff. There's a nine. Okay. Marauding captain. That's super nice. I'll have to go back and watch my own video to see like what exactly was ours and what wasn't. <laughs> okay. Creature swap. Nice. Uh, Royal Command, a XY Dragon Cannon, Air Knight Parshat. Ooh, that's a pretty sick nine. That's a pretty sick nine. A little bit off center, but that's normal for LOD. So nine is still really good. Uh, Hades, another nine. A Pharaonic Guardian. Uh, that's not a Pharaonic Guardian. That's a Hell Palmer from Pharaonic Guardian. Okay. Uh, Yamada Dragon. Yeah, decent grades here. We're getting a lot of nines, which is not exactly what you want, but they're also not too bad. And Mask of Restrict. Mask of Restrict, a Destiny Board, and can we get a 10? Ooh, a Nightmare Wheel 8. And next we have, oh, Maximum Gold Infinite Impermanence. Wow, Maximum Gold came out this long ago? Wow, that's crazy, actually. All right, a number 9. A number 9. You Bell the Ultimate Nightmare. Okay, that's a sick card. Unfortunately, just an 8. A Duelist Pack Jade and Yuki. All right, Bubble Illusions. Uh, look, reprints. Back at it again. Megamorph. Yep, got an 8. Okay, shocking. Look, if there's anything you learned from this video, don't send in reprints to get graded. Just don't. Okay, there's an 8. Okay. Because you will get a terrible grade. That's what it seems like. Uh, Spellbinding Sir. I don't know if they just can't tell that it's a reprint. I mean, they, they label them as reprint. Maybe it's just that the scratching is that bad. Okay. PSA 9. Oh, it's not a reprint. It's DB2. Okay. Never mind. I was about to say, that's actually a success, but DB2 is still sick. Oh, a 10. He got a 10 on the DB2 Guardian Sphinx. That's actually sick. That's a really good one. Oh, and that's nice too. Crystal Beast Sapphire Pegasus from Force of the Breaker Ultra Rare. That's a good one as well. Okay, he's getting some good cards. Oh, a 5. I think we just jinxed him. CRV Unlimited. Wing Creebo level 10. Ugh. Okay, 5. Oh, DB2. Okay, Obnoxious Celtic. That's not too bad. Ooh, Korean. Okay. He had some good luck with the Korean stuff last time. We got a DMG 10. Oh, we almost spoke it into existence. I didn't even know that was the next card. And. Oh, Korean Blue Eyes White Dragon PSA 10. So we got a Portuguese and a Korean 10 here. And a near mid 7 reprint. We still have like 80 cards left. So we're still going strong. Let's see what else. Wait, I did grade two of these. Luminous Soldier, PSA 10. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's go. Didn't we pull two of those? No, maybe, did Rhyme send me one? I can't remember exactly. That's a sick one. Oh, the Millennium Shield, why? I just sent another one of these in and an express return just for fun in another video. So hopefully that one will do better than an eight, unfortunately. Then, oh, a Moth from MRD. I forgot I even submitted this. PSA 10, is that's insanely sick, actually. Oh no, the Bacano Moth! No! PSA 9! I think it was off center, wasn't it? I think it was a little bit OC. Ah, oh, the PSA 9. Why? Weevil is going to be very angry about this submission. We have, oh, a Spirit Message A. Ooh, that's pretty sick. I don't remember submitting a lot of this stuff. Oh no, the L! Taking the L and getting a 9, unfortunately. Okay. Oh, look, a TP1 common. That's sick. Kuwagata. That's a nice. Gi a flea. A harmless little flea. The giant flea, actually. That's a PSA 10. Lava Golem. Did I submit this? I don't remember if this is mine or his. 
PSA 9. Either way, that's still a nice grade. A little bit off-centered. I'm going to have to check uh, the video, as I said before. Okay. Paladin White Dragon. I'm pretty sure these are his. I don't remember submitting Paladin, but I could be wrong. Ooh, Chaos Command. All right, all right. Tyrant Dragon, a 9. All right. These are actually pr pretty good grades he's getting. A 9 first. Oh, that's SDP. I thought it was MRLs. Like, that's a big card. Even though SDP is still sick. Oh, a PSA 10 starter deck Joey? I don't remember whose this is, but I think it might be his. Either way, that's an incredible, that's an incredible one. And we got Last Warrior 9, sick. That's amazing. Torrential, that would have been a big 10. Okay, can we get a big 10 here? Save return. Okay, that's another 9. Oh, XYZ Dragon Cannon, that's a 9. Sphinx an 8. Okay, that was still really good if those were all his. <sighs> Oh, a Grand Neos. Okay, a nine. That's an ultra rare. I just submitted an ultimate rare of that. Oh, Cyber Dark, a nine. You know, I love this good Cyber Dark Dragon. Oh! Elemental Hero Air Neos Gem Mint 10. It's not an ulti or anything, but as you know, if you guys know anything about Air Neos and how ridiculous it is, how long it's been, it's only has one print. Just Strike of Neos, Ultra Rare, and Ultimate Rare in that same set. It has never been reprinted. That is huge. Like, even the Ultra is super expensive. So a Gem Mint 10, that's a big, that's one of the biggest cards of the return. That's insane. I know that's not mine. So congrats, Yugi Vault. That is insane, dude. Okay, then an eight, but you'd much rather have the, the Air Neos anyway. Okay, an ultimate rare. That's a very cool looking card. Uh, okay, an eight. Uh, okay, not great. A marked eight? Whoa, we got a marked card. It's the first time I've ever graded a marked card. Okay, where is it marked? Marked usually means it's like written on or something. Hello, does anyone see a mark? Maybe up on the border somewhere? Maybe it's like down here, but like that's normal. Sometimes it just gets darker. Maybe that's what they're talking about. That has to be it. I don't know. That's weird. I've never seen a marked card like in my own return. But as I said, I didn't expect them or anything. So it could have been marked. I don't know. Uh, Doom Shaman. It's like usually when it's like unintentionally marked is, is a marked. And then like recolored is when they won't grade it, which I don't really get the difference. Like one is intentional, one's not. Who cares? They're still marked. <laughs> okay. A Aquarian Alessa. A Silver Sentinel 7. Ouch. Okay. Sevens. An 8 Zombie Man. Man, this would have been a sick, like, 9 or 10, but unfortunately got the 8. Still awesome. Oh, this is the uh, Super Electromagnetic Voltec Dragon. Electromagnetic. I can't even say it. Okay, another one. He got an 8. A lot of ultis here. That's cool. Ooh, Super Ancient Deep Sea Coalent. Colacanth. Colacanth. Okay. That is, these are very difficult to say. Ooh, wow, that's so beautiful, but an eight. Yeah, it's Flaming Eternity. I bet the back had the scuffing and stuff on it. Yeah, it did. That's why. Such a beautiful card, though. Ooh, and Zector get a five. Oh, this is in the era where it's like the cards are ripply. You see that little dent thing back there? They're very ripply. Like, they come out of the pack like that. So that, I bet that's what it was. Cyber Phoenix, that's an eight. A Rose Warrior of the Revenge. These ultis are getting killed right now. Bizer Shock, nine. All right. All right, all right. Oh, an eight. That's such a cool card. Legendary Collection, Yugi's World. That actually, that might be mine. I'm not really sure. Oh, this is mine. Yeah, this is mine. Okay, Blackluster Soldier, Super Soldier. We pulled this one out of docks a long time ago. Ah, it would have been nice, Tim. Still a cool card. Man, this has been such a roller coaster. Oh, a nine. Wait, I graded an SYE Unlimited? I don't know. Maybe I did. Maybe I did. I'm going to be double checking all these because I'm just second guessing everything. An eight. Okay, it's a reprint. Shocking. Please no more reprints. Oh, come on. It's just going to be giving us eights. Come on. Stop it. Stop it. A seven. <sighs> reprint hate is real. Oh, a clock tower prison. We finally didn't get a 10. I have three tens of this. So we finally got an eight on that. Energy absorbing monolith. Did I actually grade these or are these not mine? I don't think I graded this. I'm pretty sure those are his. So that was a PSA 10 ulti though. That's sick. Yeah, those are definitely his. Okay, I, I'm i going to have to check the Trihorns. I don't know. Force Focus Ulti. The Ultis are having a rough time today, that's for sure. Okay, and a 7. Ouch. An 8. Ouch. The Susanoo. No. Zen Maester. That's a 9, at least. Okay. Uh, Voltanus. I had some unlucky uh, times with Voltanus. Don Zalug. Speed Duels Trial of the Kingdom. That's pretty sick. All right, PSA 10. Ooh, Magician of Black Chaos. Another 10. Another 10. Oh my gosh, these speed duel cards. 
Oh, a max seed. Nice. That's actually awesome. Maybe somebody can throw that in their uh, master duel deck. We have done it, ladies and gentlemen. We're on to the final 20 cards of the return. So I don't know who's or who's, but we're about to see uh, Amazonist Swordswoman. I don't remember whose that is, but that's a nice 10. I think this is mine. I'm pretty sure I graded this. Revival Jam, unfortunately, got a 9. Wait. There's two of them. Did I grade two? Okay, now I'm really questioning everything. Skilled White? I don't remember. I mean, we're going to be double checking. Oh, whoa, that's a big card. Skilled Dark Magician, PSA 10. I think this is pretty low pop. I hope that's mine. <laughs> I hope it is. And uh, Bazoo got a nine. All right. Confiscation got a nine. Oh, tribe infecting virus from Magician's Force. Okay, that's a card. Somebody got a PSA 10. One of the two of us. Z Metal Tank. All right, a nine. Okay, Dark Spirit of the Silent. Another nine. Oh, another Magician's Force 10. I feel like I did grade some of these, but I don't know. There's a nine on the uh, Defusion. A nine on the Mask of the Accursed. A nine on the Kaiku, come on. Nine on the Ryokuville. Can we get another 10 for the end of this? Ooh, Magician's Force. What, whatever this came from, the Magician's Force cards are balling right now. Why Dragon Head? Okay, that's a good one. Ooh, the Blue Eyes Ultimate Retro Pack 1. Got a nine. No, that's still sick. And... Okay, that's definitely not mine. Do or is it mine? Dusa? I don't remember. Last card of the return, guys. Hope you guys have enjoyed this. A little bit more fast-paced because we have so many different cards. Roller coaster ride for sure. Can we end it on a nice note? Oh, that would have been a nice note if that was a 10. Still sick as a 9. Overall, I'm, I ended up being happy with that. Started off very disappointed and upset with how it was starting with the reprints. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe for more epic content. Don't forget to enter this giveaway for a Ghost Rare Blue Eyes Alternative Dragon. That's going to be pretty amazing. Shout out to TCG, Trusted Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Echo, Daxter, Emusa, Junior Barding, and Tai Show, JT Cho, and Anima the Howl. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.